Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're really excited for today's video. I have my Boston Terrier Bloom here with me and we are going to be opening up a Chewy box. We really don't have any subscribers yet because we just started this video and it's totally new. So please like and subscribe and give a big thumbs up and smash that like button. Chewy is a website for animals where you can get a bunch of toys, food, um, accessories, whatever you really need for your dogs or cats or whatever animal that you may have. Hey, sit. Good girl. We like ordering off of there because there's a lot of variety and the stuff is usually pretty um, reliable. Like it doesn't break as often as like cheaper toys and Bloom really seems to like it. So I brought her with me for today. She's just like waiting for the treats. Please give me treats. Um, and we're gonna start opening up this box. Okay, Bloomy. So this is what an average size box comes like. Just says Chewy.com. Their shipping is usually very fast. Um, and you can even auto ship things like your food and I think treats and maybe like shampoos and that type of stuff, like stuff that you would need on a regular basis and they actually give discounts for that. So, but I will say we got mostly toys. So, because Bloom has been in quarantine, come here, let's show them, let's show them. Since we've been staying at home so much and we haven't been able to get out as much, um, Lumi here has eaten up a bunch of her treats. She's chewed up a bunch of her toys and kind of destroyed some of them. So we really needed to do this and get her some more. Do you want to see what kind of toys you've got? Yes, they're being so good. Here, Lumi. Let's see. Ooh, okay. Are you excited? So this is the Kong Wubba. It squeaks and it has these fun things that you can pull on. Let's see. Like, um, this is the size small, but oh, she loves it. She automatically sits. That's a good girl. Um, let me cut it out for you, girl. And we wanted toys that have like a um, have like things that you can pull on because she loves just tugging at those. Bloom is a 10 month old Boston Terrier, and let me get this tag off for you and she just loves to chew on things. She's really good puppy. Um, she doesn't chew on anything that's not a toy, but she just loves to chew and she's destroyed so much. So I think that she'll really like this. She hasn't had a toy like this before, but I think that it's gonna be fun. Yes, get it, get it. Come on, you wanna play tug? Yes, yes. Good girl, good girl. Yes, there's a good girl. Oh, she runs away with it. Lumi, look. There's more. Oh, cool, let's get out something that I know that she loves. This is the Kong um, Easy Treat Peanut Butter. She is obsessed with this stuff, like so obsessed. Uh, we actually don't, we have the Kong that you can put it in, but we usually don't use it for that. We just um, kind of give it to her with her medicine. Um, she's been taking some skin medicine recently because she's been itching in weird spots. So, we give it to her once a day with her medicine and it just makes things so easy um, to, I guess, take down for her because peanut butter can be kind of thick for her, but this is like, oh, like she come running over here. Yes, that's a good girl. Is this your peanut butter? Is this your peanut butter? Um, this is like the good stuff. It's super like thin and creamy. Yes, come get it, hey, come get it. Good girl. And we were out of this. So I actually probably should even order another because we go through it so quick. But this is one of her favorite treats. She's just licking it off. I think we run it off there. This is a good girl. She loves this. And I would definitely recommend to pet owners, um, if your dogs like little snacks or love peanut butter, you should definitely get that. Hey, come over here. What's another toy? Let's see what else we got in there. Oh, Bloom, look at this. Yes. What is this? It's a monkey. Anyone else just talk to their dogs like their babies? 
No. Oh, she's already tugging on it. Yes, good girl. Does it squeak? I don't think it squeaks, but oh my gosh, yes, she is gonna love this. She loves rope toys. Come here, good girl. She loves rope toys, um, especially ones that have something in the middle between me and her. Um, she will just tug and she'll actually chew on this. She loves stuffed animals, so I think this is gonna be great. Hold on, before you take it, let me cut the tag off. Jeez, hold on, stay, sit. Good girl. She's very well behaved, especially for just being a baby. Hey, want a treat? Look, sit, high five. Good girl. All right, you went to monkey? Oh, this is so soft and it like feels super durable and it doesn't have like any strings hanging out on the side that she can pull at and kind of unravel the whole thing. So I think this is a winner. And Blue thinks so too, good girl. Good girl. Okay, we got some more though. I'll let you play with that for a little bit. Oh my gosh, this looks huge. She is so tiny. I don't know, we might have to return this for a different size. It says it's adjustable, so we will see how adjustable it really is. I got the medium because I didn't want it to be too small on her, but it's a collar for her birthday, and it says birthday girl on it because she's about to be one, and I knew that I wanted something for her because I always take pictures of her. Oh, yes, follow Bloom the Boston on Instagram. I always take pictures of her. I knew I wanted to have a little birthday photo shoot, so I got this for her, but this is huge. Like, if you could only see. Come here, Billy. Come here. Come here. Look. Hey, look how big this is. <laughs> it's like hanging down below. <gasps> well, maybe next year, actually never. She's full grown and she weighs 15.8 um, pounds last time we went to the bed. Hey, here, you want your monkey back? You take the monkey. But this is super cute and it feels durable. It just may be too big, so we'll have to see about the sizing. Granted, I did not measure her or anything, so I can't really say for sure, like, it was definitely my fault, you know, it wasn't, it wasn't their fault. Oh, I'm so excited for this. This is the Chuck It, and I love this brand, Chuck It Tennis Ball, but it is a rubber ball and it has these little frills on the end, and she is gonna tear this up. She's gonna love this. Look, Lil, are you so excited? Yes. So, Look, she's already sitting. I wish you could see everything, but we don't have that good of a setup. So yes, I love this. And I don't know if anyone else's dogs do this. Um, comment down below if they do or don't or any tips or tricks. But she has been really tearing the fur off of tennis balls, like aggressively. And I can't even leave tennis balls sitting around anymore because she just will tear and tear and tear and eat the fur. She loves cotton. Yeah, let me see that. Ah, bad catch on my part. So here's an example. Like she will just tear at this fur. It's so, so crazy. I don't know what is up with it. Like, but we can't even keep them. Oh, here it is. We can't even keep them out anymore because she just tears it up so, so much. So, but this is like a rubber one. There will be no fur to tear off. Um, and I think, what do you like it, Bloom? Come here, come, sit. Can you shake, shake? Good girl. High five, sit. Good. I think that she really likes that. Okay, so, oh, this is another toy that's pretty similar. Um, it has like the ruffles and I know that she's just gonna tear and tear and tear at these. Look, Bloom, you're so excited. You're being very good for this video, coming over for every toy I get out. Ah. Okay, yes, yeah, so this is the Kong Extra Small. Um, it's called a Goody Bone. And it has a chewy part in the middle here, but you can pull on each side. Whoa, you're ready, girl. You can pull on each side. She can pull at these strings. She can chew on this middle. Get it, get it. Oh yeah, she's gonna love this. She is already going in. She's being a great participant today. Thank you for that. Okay, okay, you want it, you can have it. Seems like it's a 10 out of 10 for Bloom. Um, yeah, again, that was the Kong um, Goody Bone. Sue's gums and fun to chew. So I think that she's really gonna love that. She already does, she took it away. Oh, look at this. Okay, so we got a Chuck It, another, the brand that I like again for throwing. Um, 
This kind of looks big for her, honestly, but the other one we had is so small. This is called the Flying Squirrel, and this is in size small. It's not extra small, and I know they do have that, but this is in size small. So, do you like it? Um, flying Squirrel, you throw it, and I think that it kind of goes like up and then down, maybe? I could be wrong, but it's for fetching. We will open it up and see what she thinks. Oh, you're ready. She's ready. Okay. Okay, so it's really flexible. It is like bigger than her head. <laughs> Come here. Are you, why are you scared of it? One see? Pull. Good girl. But she can definitely carry it. It's not heavy at all. I don't know if she'll be able to catch it. I don't know about that. But for right now she loves pulling on it that's for sure and i think once we get outside on a nice day we'll throw it and it looks like i'm just like playing with myself like she's not here but she's beneath the camera she already ran in the other room with that oh i'm excited about these these are the true acre food um hearty bones long lasting flavored dog treats contains omega fatty acids peanut butter flavor, hard chews. They don't contain corn, wheat, or soy, source of omega-3 and six fatty acids, no artificial ingredients, 100% rawhide free. So this is what the bag looks like, and we have never tried these before. She's like licking your lips. Like. <laughs> We've never tried these before, but we are always looking for a good bone for her to chew on while we eat dinner because like whenever we eat dinner, she's usually like pawing at our legs, like trying to get us to give her some. But every time we eat, we give her a bone um, and preferably one that she can like chew on for a while, but also get something out of, if that makes sense. Like we don't like the ones that go away like in 10 minutes because that doesn't occupy her long enough. And it's not as good as the value. We do have bones, get back with me, that she can like, just chew on forever and they're not really edible like you can get a little bits and pieces off but they're not really edible but we mostly give edible ones while we eat because it's more of a treat to her so these look really good she's like licking her lips i wish that you could see her she's been turned around this whole time come here bloom yeah sit you can kind of see her that's a good girl once she gets this i know that she's gonna run off so it's hard but this is the last thing in the box um i'll link everything else down below bloom can you do a trick oh you're saying shake high five sit she can lay down and roll over but i don't think you'll be able to see lay down lay down good girl okay come back up okay you can have it that's a very good girl i think that she's gonna like those um, she already ran off with it, but yeah, they're peanut butter flavor and she loves peanut butter. She is, like I said, she's a 10 month old Boston Terrier. Her favorite things are peanut butter, cheese, and like meat. She, those are her three favorite things. So we try to get everything flavored in that way. Um, this was really fun to do and I hope to do some more. Um, hopefully I don't have to keep buying a ton of toys um, because she just has been destroying them. But I think that she really likes everything that we got. And besides the collar, everything has been like awesome. And the collar was probably totally my fault. I just guessed on the sizing and we can return it and get a new size before her birthday. She will be one year old, one year old? She'll be one on um, May 30th and we might have a little puppy birthday party. I don't know, there'll definitely be some pictures on Instagram though. So follow her at Bloom the Boston. Thank you guys so much for watching. We really hope that you enjoyed this. If you have Boston Terriers or other dogs, comment down below. I would love to see them or hear about them because she's just like the joy of my life. I love her so much. She's a great dog and if I can make more videos with her, I definitely will. Maybe some like training and trick videos because she does know quite a few tricks. Say bye. Thanks for watching. So please be a subscriber. This one of you, I don't care how much there is. This one of you. I love you whoever subscribed. You are the best whoever subscribed. You will be one of my fans forever, guys. I love you guys, whoever subscribed. Bye. Peace out.